Mama's Family, 1983, cast Cullen, then and now left bracket time has made cast horribly old. Anne Haney is Alberta Meacham in the movie Grandma 52 years old, sadly she passed away on May the 26th, 2001, Los Angeles, California, USA from congestive heart failure at the age of 67. Wrong with Bubba? Well, he is a known felon who has served time in reform school. No offense, Bubba. 50 mark down from 10. I'll give you the raise. Here's your raise. Alan Kayser as Bubba Higgins joined the film when he was 34 years old, and now he's 60 years old, but still retains his form. Did you know you're out of ice cream? <laughs> Bubba Higgins, what in the world are you doing here? Well, I got out three months early. For good behavior. I'm, done. I'm having a blast. It's so good to be back at the con. <laughs> I, I, I couldn't agree more. Mm -hmm. I couldn't agree yeah. more. Vicky Lawrence is Thelma Harper when she appeared in the film she was 34 years old, and now she's 74 years old. <laughs> Rainy, are you keeping something from me? Why, no. You uh, are, you uh, know, you can't keep a secret. I would prefer not to be seen. Please yeah. get me two seats way in the back so mm -hmm. I can sneak in and sneak out, and then I will call you in a couple weeks, sweetie, and we'll have lunch. Dorothy Lyman as Naomi Oates Harper when she joined the series she was 36 years old, and now she is 76 years old. Ever met a man who swept you off your feet and made you go so weak in the knees that you could no longer tell right from wrong? I need to call my audition. They changed their concept of the part and hired me. Um... And Kim Delaney and I, you know, it was her... Harvey Corman as Ed Higgins while filming him at the age of 56, sadly passed away on May the 29th, 2008, Ronald Reagan UCLA Medical Center, Los Angeles, California, USA, from complications of an aneurys aneurysm broken belly holder. To be anything else, there was a time there where the little twig was bent. I thought I had the calling to spread the Lord's word. And doing stuff like that. And of course, all the surprises he had for me. And then this kind of very, it's a very subtle thing. People don't. Betty White is Ellen Harper while watching the movie. She's 62 years old. Unfortunately, she passed away on December the 31st, 2021. Brentwood, Los Angeles, California, USA. She died in her sleep at her home. Digest. Well, how nice. March and June, 1974. <laughs> because whoever came to town, would come through our show. It was the only game in town, and uh, so we would, you'd meet everybody. Jeffrey Lewis is called Kane Maker while filming. He was 48 years old. He died on April the 7th, 2015, Woodland Hills, Los Angeles, California, USA, of a heart attack at the age of 79. Hey, my niece. You're gonna give him the $2,000, aren't you? Yes. He'll do it. Remember, $400 of that is mine for the finders. He was fee. gonna go do that at the time. And he said, I want this guy. He saw me in the other movie. Beverly Archer as Eola Lucille Boylan when she was acting, she was 35 years old, and now she is 75 years old. Processor. Well, I'm all for a happier life. <laughs> as you become familiar with your Lee process, you'll discover it to be your best friend in the kitchen. And Pavan was the only one who actually answered me when I wrote to him and said, uh, I'm still here, I'm not dead. Is there anything we can do uh, about this? Rue McClanahan as Frances Marie Crowley in the film. She was 49 years old. Sadly, she passed away on June the 3rd, 2010. New York Presbyterian, New York City, New York State, USA from a brain hemorrhage. Tangled web we weave when first we practice to deceive. Spit it out, friend. It's hit the fan, Naomi. <laughs> <laughs> Tell them better yeah. on their way. How smart of them to consider me. So I went over, read for Rose, and Jay Sandwich said, I'm going to ask you to do something. I'm Ken Berry is Vinton Hopper in the movie. He was 50 years old. Sadly, he passed away on December the 1st, 2018. Providence St. Joseph Medical Center, Burbank, California, USA, of heart complications. I've never been that close to a dead person before. Oh, Anthony, for crying out loud, the casket's got handles. I ain't asking you to give her a piggyback ride. To the restaurant and brought out some uh, booze and we had, and we, and we went on. Went on talking about the concept of the show and...